Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing a, another fragrance review. Uh, and we are reviewing this beautiful scent. I love this fragrance. This is Invictus from Paco Rabanne. It says right there, Invictus. It's a little hard to read, but you can see that. Um, Invictus from Paco Rabanne. If you would enjoy it, please make sure to subscribe, like, turn on post notifications. Without any further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so let's begin. Oh, there we go. So Invictus is an extremely popular fragrance. It's one of Pablo Rabanne's most popular, you know, along with his one million line. I have to admit, I love this. When I bought Phantom from Paco Rabanne, um, I had a little tiny, like maybe two milliliter sample uh, of Invictus that came with it. And I'm like, wow, I like Invictus a lot. I ended up selling Phantom, so no more Paco Rabanne, but now I have this. Pocket Rabanne's back in my collection. It's a very fresh and clean scent. It's also, of course, woody and aromatic and a little, little sweet, smoky. It's a lot of fragrances. So this is fresh and clean and like woody. So is Bleu de Chanel. Oh, it is Aqua de Geo, even though it's a little more just floral. So is Eros from Versace. So is, not really, but Wild de Parfum, Yves Saint Laurent, and all of these. So, you know, it's a common thing. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, because I don't think it is. I think it's a great thing, but, you know, it's quite the common thing. Oh, shoot, i got to move these back. Wait up. Oh, and remember, guys, we're reviewing this tomorrow. This is Blue Cedar and Cypress from Cremo. It's probably one of the best you can ever buy. Like, cheap. It's so freaking good. I think this is probably better than Invictus, but besides the point. Okay, back to Invictus, though. So, this scent is really nice, okay? It's really masculine, you say, but I, I could see it being unisex, too. And we're going to look at the notes here. And this is the Eau de Toilette Original. There are many flankers of Invictus, but this is the OG Invictus. So this is a relatively simple fragrance, not the most simple, but it's not too complicated. Um, at the top, you have sea notes, grapefruit, and mandarin orange. So it's an extreme. It is an extremely citrusy opening. Definitely. Middle notes are bay leaf and jasmine, so more of a floral heart. And the base notes are ambergris, guaiac wood, oak moss, and patchouli. So you see that you know classic woody, musky kind of more heavy and dark harsh finish uh, at the base so you know not something you don't not something that's so unique and while this isn't too much of a unique scent it is definitely good okay performance relatively good as well all right you're gonna get about six hours with this fragrance uh, maybe maybe even more uh, projection is definitely you know it's not amazing but it's all right it's all right yeah about two feet maybe maybe not so much but you know two feet in my in mind's eyes pretty good um, this is a nice little bottle here. There's um, 3.4 ounce, 100 milliliter bottle. That's $95 full retail. Thank you so much, Auntie Dana, for making this uh, possible for me to own this. She got this for me for my birthday, so $95 full retail. And I believe the 1.7 ounce, 50 uh, uh, milliliter is about $74 full retail. So definitely go with this size bottle because, again, it's only $21 more for double the size. You will be getting scammed if you get a smaller bottle because you'll just be spending $21 less to get half the size. It's worth it to upgrade, and this will last double the time. I love the bottle design. It's a damn trophy. Like, woo, woo. Um, it has, like, nice, like, textured, like, sides. It says Paco Rabanne there, and then it says Invictus on top. And it has a really nice atomizer. It's like right there, you can see, and then there's like the top, so it's a pretty heavy. 
little thing there. Nice, like, stub down here for the trophy, so it just sets down quite uh, quite nicely. Really good scent. Um, just a very overall pleasing fragrance, and there's not really much to say about it, I guess, besides the fact that it's just an overall people pleaser scent. It's very nice. It's very, very clean, um, and it's not very offensive at all. I wouldn't say, um, so yeah, very nice scent. Invictus from Paco Rabanne, the original Eau de Toilette for men. Um, remember the 100 milliliter 3.4 ounce bottle is $95, the 50 milliliter 1.7 ounce bottle is $74. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Mr. Cool signing out. Uh, subscribe, like, turn on post notifications, and there's my Invictus review. Uh, super lovely, clean, and woody scent. Thank you. Oh, by the way, one more thing. Uh, definitely good for the warm weather. Not so much for the cold weather at all. Uh, our next, the, uh, the Cremel one is very versatile, but this is not so much versatile. Only spring, summer for this one. All right, thanks for watching. Actually, mm, the, it's kind of like woody with the C notes, but yeah, I'll stick to warm weather for this. All right, thanks for watching. Peace.